Jesus. 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 See my time has come. Please, copyright. Should start that music, huh? We have come on to the Lord. We have come on to the Lord. We have come. We have come. Jesus, we have come. Daddy. We have come. Jesus, we have come. Daddy. We have come. We have come. We have come to the fight. We have come. We have come. Jesus, we have come. Daddy. We have come. Jesus, we have come. Daddy. We have come, Jesus, we have come, Daddy. Oh, we have come, Jesus, we have come, Daddy. Oh, we have come, Jesus, we have come. Of the enemy in my life 
be paralyzed in the name of Jesus Christ. Shout Jesus. No matter what you are going through, don't close your mouth. Don't do what close your mouth. You must keep declaring what God wants to hear. I be it must come to pass. Say my time has come. Genesis 1, 1 to 3, the Bible says, in the beginning, God created heaven and the earth. And the earth was without form and void. And darkness was upon the face of the deep. And the Spirit of God moved upon the face of the water. And God said, let there be light and there was light. In the midst of what was happening, what we are copying was not seeing darkness, it was seeing the opposite. Little bit, you are 27. Say, enough is enough. Say, enough is enough. Say, by the blood of Jesus, say, I command him. every power on assignment to destroy me. What are you waiting for? Receive one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. To every power on a summit to destroy me, be arrested and die. Say, that's enough. To every pit of destruction they have done for me, the digger of the evil pit. Fall into that pit. Now. Fall into that pit. Shout Jesus. See, enough is enough. See, I command them. All my doors of ritual, my doors of favor, my doors of blessing, begin to open. Open up. Open up. Open up. Shout Jesus. Who's that man in the back? Please come to the front. Come to the front. You, that man, that, those men. Who's that man? The one there, the one at the back, at the back. Come to the front. What are you adding? Yeah, come to the front, it doesn't matter. Say my time has come, come to the front. Your time has come. For God to take you out of back seat to the front. There is ages surrounding us. Most time people are not aware that ages are surrounded by us. And what is their work? To take your information to God. Most, most time people are not aware of the true power that is, that is in the word of God at work. In their life, if men know what is in the word of God, what is succeeded in the word of God, they will be less worried and more depending on what God says. I declare that to the word, you'll be less worried. That your issue, you'll be less worried as you depend. On the integrity of the power of God. The earth and all we know about it was created by the word of God. Everything about you, you depend on the word of God. What will happen to you tomorrow depend on what God says concerning your tomorrow. And you believe what God says concerning your tomorrow, then you declare what God says. I to come to pass. It does not matter what the doctors say. It does not matter what people around you say. It does not matter what the war is saying. Declare what you want to say coming to pass tomorrow. This should, when you depend on that, it will give you comfort and assurance because it means that your tomorrow is not in any man's hand. Your tomorrow is not in doctor's hand. Your tomorrow is not in your 
husband or wife had is in God's hand. Your breakthrough is in God's hand. That which you are believing God for is in God's hand. So if God has said it, believe it. It will come to pass. Just like a poet may say, oh, the word is coming to an end. Which word? Third word. Which third word? That's what God told me. He tell me that. Your healing, your testimony, your deliverance, your open doors, your miracle, all depend solidly on the word of God. Bible says in John 1 verse 1, See, in the beginning was the word, and the word was with God, and the word was God. Before the chaos, before that crisis, before that confusion, before that challenge, the word of God concerning your, your life has to be settled. It's already settled. It's already there. What goes out will become. That's what I'm doing today. And yet, I was not qualified. There is no way I could be here, but God has said so. So if God says so, believe it, and it is done. Romans 8, 28 said, and we know that all things work together for good to them that love God, to them who are called according to his purpose. Nothing happen until God speak. Chaos may exist, but once God speak, the word, that your chaos must change. Confusion and crisis exist, but when God speak, what God said come to pass. When God created the heaven and the earth, the Bible tells us that it was formless and void. When God spoke, and God spoke concerning it, he said, let there be light. The state of confusion and chaos continue until the moment God said, let there be light with his mouth open. And there was light. Let there be light. There was no light there. But he said, let there be light. That your request will come to pass. Amen. But you must keep declaring it. Let there be. No matter the amount of darkness. No matter the darkness surrounding you. There's no matter whether the doctor have condemned every, every part of your body. Let there be light. The very moment God speak, that was the end of confusion. That's why you must keep declaring what you want to see coming. That's why I, I know I have not arrived yet. I'm just starting. The very moment what God said came to pass, every situation in your life that is without form and void, only need the word, not from men. You will open your mouth this morning and said, "In this my issue that I'm going through, let there be light. Let there be light. In this my matrimony issue, let there be light. Wherever you find darkness, open your mouth and declare light upon it. Cause confusion into the camp of your enemy." Declare your right. Declare your right this morning. Declare light to every darkness in your life. In my finance, let there be light. In my head, let there be light. In other causes, me, let there be light. In my children's life, let there be light. Open your mother, declare it. Every affliction receive the blood of Jesus. Say enough, enough. Say enough, enough. Say by the blood of Jesus. Say I command. By the blood of Jesus. Say I break every evil covenant 
of limitation. Every covenant of limitation, draw me back. I break you. Begin to break them. Whatever that is drawing your back, break them. Whatever that is limiting me from moving forward, I break you. I destroy you. In the name of Jesus Christ, begin to break them and destroy them. Jesus, as I just said, over so say, Thus say the Lord God, it shall not stand, neither shall it come to pass. I will declare that whatever the enemy has programmed in my life will not stand, will not come to pass. Whatever they have programmed in my life this year will not come, will not come to pass. Open your mouth. Jesus, say by the blood of Jesus, say I command every pronouncement, every pronouncement, if pronouncement made over my life and my destiny, break now. Every evil pronouncement made over my life by my brother, by my sister, by my relation, break it. Break it! Break it! They are a church and a castle. They are evil castle and the plan of us old wickedness over my life be destroyed they are a jet and a castle the evil castle and the plan of us old wickedness over my life I reject them I castle them we get to reject their plan castle their plan open your mouth Open your mouth. Reject them. Castle them. Every invocation. And the plan of the household wickedness. Reject them now. Shout Jesus. Say by the strap of Jesus, by the strap of Jesus, I command the backbone of evil power. Arise, the master, break now, break now, break now, break now, break now. Shout, Jesus. Zechariah now, verse eleven. As for thee also. By the blood of the covenant, I have set forth the prisoners out of the pit we are in. It's no water. Say enough, say enough. Say by the blood of Jesus. Say I lose myself from every pit that the enemy of my destiny have dug for me. I lose myself. 
command the enemy to fall into the pit. Command them to fall into the pit. Every pit they have done for me. Command the diggers to fall into that pit. Come up with your mouth. Command them to fall into that pit. Every digger. Whosoever digging a pit for me. From a village, from a town. I command you. Enter into it. Command every arrow. Every arrow of sickness, every arrow of affliction, whatever arrow they are fired into my life, come on the arrow, go back to Seda. Every arrow fire into my children's life, go back to Seda. Every arrow fire into my destiny, go back to Seda. Open your mouth. Command every arrow of destruction released against me. They are resisted. Command the arrow to go back to Seda. Every arrow of destruction go back to Seda. Every evil arrow of destruction right back to Seda. Give your honor. Open your mouth and pray. Every arrow of cancer, every arrow of disease, right up at the Every hour of destruction, fire in the no day, fire in the morning, fire in the night, go back to Seda. Jesus. A man came to me yesterday. No, she was as if the if the stomach was almost nine months pregnant. Then he has to be a b- b- big jacket. That look, it not look very fat. And I told him, I said, God is telling me that. Um, a lot of affliction. When you are sleeping, this what comes to you. You eat any hour, you will shock. You eat in your dream. That's what. When the man opened his stomach, I was shocked. As big as this. But the jacket covered it up. I said, God, how long? He said, can't even remember. So what you be carrying about? At least a woman will deliver in a month's time. But when are you delivering? As I measure, 
two deliverers. He said, I stay very far. I said, well, you're not speaking the truth. God put me up straight. Up. Most, of, most of them, what they are carrying is what they were about to give to somebody. Some him, what they carry eh, is what they, they have said them, go and deliver it. But person like you that was here, you are too old. Person that go and deliver that it all was too old. So he, he has to carry it for the rest of his life. So you have to be the spirit is for you to be hot is very important for you to be on fire for God. That's why when, when, when I'm DM, I see you're not doing the right thing. I said, remove your cap, remove this. So you, you know what you are doing. Learn how to be violent. I know we have new people that don't know how to pray. But you have to see what they are doing. No, this, all this mask. When you want to fight somebody, if you want to fight the devil with mask, the devil will say, "You can't do it again." When it comes to prayer, if you want to, if you, don't, if you believe that um, God's present, there's COVID here, yeah, then you you can you can change. What happens again? Divide yourself. But you must pray. This idea of tying your mouth. Why are you coming to church when you know that um, you cannot open your mouth closed? No, open your mouth and pray. Your mouth is an instrument of war. It's an instrument of war. Does that mean? Will you, will you, I mean, this is a church. That even when COVID was killing people, it did not kill anybody in VPA. It did not look at a big church. COVID could not kill anybody in VPA. So we know who we are in Christ. It is time to open your mask and pray. Because mask is not your mask does not see, see, listen to me. COVID is a spirit. Spirit, evil spirit. It can enter anywhere. No, but all this mask they say you cover was just to, to just to make you feel you are, you are secured. It just fit. And yet, people wear masks and they die. Yeah. Devil. You don't need plane to fly. Uh-uh. Before you get to London, it's already there. The witch. So learn to pray. If you don't trust your neighbor, go and stay in the go and stay near the wall <laughs> and pray, pray, and live. pray. So your miracle can come. Go to pray that every arrow, every arrow. the enemy, every discovery was an arrow. Yeah. You throw it when you are naked, when you are when you are empty, he attached to you. I was in the same car with him, ask him. And yet, he had, we, we went up. He has COVID. I don't have COVID. One up. Am I correct? Ask him. I have bought. That's why these days, when I said I want to stay here, I want to, I'll make sure, even though God still deliver me, he's still going to open, to hear the voice of God. That was what I was telling you to the lady that said, Don't want to stay there. If I said, No, leave me alone. Because there was nothing happened lately. And I see, I was there. They give me this to eat as I eat it. For you, after eating it, I'm vomiting blood. If I was not strong in God, people vomit blood, you are dead already. But the Bible said, Because the word of God is already inside me. When you eat deadly things, when you eat deadly thing, it will not hurt you. So, that's the word of God. That's what God said. And I believe the word of God. The little I know, walk like fire. So, memorize the word of God 
into your, your, your system. What was that? It came from. Don't want anybody in this church. If anybody is not not my yeah, please be me spirit. Don't drive my member away. I'm gonna pray. Every arrow of the wicked. Every arrow of destruction. Fire into my life. Receive fire. Return back to center. Open your mouth. Jesus! Psalm 91 verse 5 said, Thou shalt not be afraid for the terror by night, nor for the arrow that fired by day. You can see this is real. The Bible said, don't be afraid. See a command. Every evil arrow fired against me. Be all protected. Return back to Seda. Return back to Seda. Every evil arrow fired against me. Return back to Seda. Every arrow of destruction. Return back to Seda. Return back to Seda. Return back to Seda. Jesus! We will pray with power now. We will pray power. So, whatsoever, whatsoever, any power, sorcery, disgrace into my life, be arrested, lose me, lose me, lose me, I be disgraced. Sponsor this grace into my life. Be arrested. Lose me and die. Say my time of breakthrough has come. Say my time of breakthrough has come. It has come. As I am 59 verse 90 said. So shall they fear the name of the Lord. From the west. And the glory. From the rising of the storm. When the enemy shall come in like a flood. The spirit of the Lord. Shall lift up a standard against them. That is where you know. How to war. Where you know. How to pray. As they, as they throw. You go back to Seda. As a troll, you go back to Seda. We pray. Say, by the Spirit of the Living God, I raise up the standard of the blood of Jesus against my enemy. Against my enemy. Pray, my prayer. They are raised up. Say, by the Spirit of the Living God. I raise up standard of the blood of Jesus against the flood of the enemy in my life. Open your mouth and pray. Shut Jesus. Say along with me. Say by the spirit of the living God. I raise up the standard of the blood of Jesus 
against my enemy. Pray that prayer. Shout Jesus to receive the grace to move forward. Grace to carry my children. Grace to achieve. I say grace for his blood. In the name of Jesus Christ. Hmm. What of God says in First Samuel 2 verse 8. God say he raised up the poor out of the dust. Tell me what is in dust. That's to tell you how powerful this God is. That there is nothing he cannot do. What is in the dust? He said he raised up the poor out of the dust and lifted up the beggar from the door here. To set them among the priests, to make them a real throne of glory. For the pillar of the earth are the Lord, and He has set the word upon them. Say the name of Jesus Christ. Say the name of Jesus Christ. So I am lifted above every negative situation. I'm lifted above this my challenge. I am lifted. Above poverty, I am lifted. Above loneliness, I am lifted. Above darkness, open your mouth. Open your mouth. I pray that prayer. I am lifted above this challenge. I am lifted above this reproach. I am lifted above. Shout Jesus! You are lifted. I say you are lifted. You are lifted. This is what God says. See, he raised up the poor out of the dust. That means God is able to lift you up. It doesn't matter where the enemy has kept you. It doesn't matter whether they say they have concluded everything about you. God said, I'm coming to, to lift you above that your challenge. Lifted. I am lifted. I am lifted by your wall. Our sorrow into the presence. I am lifted, lifted. I am lifted. I am lifted by your word. Into the presence. I am lifted, lifted. I am lifted. I am lifted by I am lifted, I am lifted, 
This morning, lift up your heart. I declare by the word of the Lord, I preserve upon your life that all the promise of God over your life will manifest fittingly. This morning, by the word of God, I command the release of all you are being expected from God into your life. Let them manifest in your life. I command every arrow of defeat set against you be defeated now. That challenges you have come here with. Be defeated now. By the blood of Jesus, be defeated. By the blood of Jesus, receive divine intervention. In every area of your life, receive it. In the name of Jesus. 
whatever has brought you before the Lord this morning, that situation, that request, that intervention, that deliverance, that healing, that prayer, that, that application, that proposal, that challenge, that issue that has made you come and seek his face this morning. By the blood of Jesus, I decree a divine answer, a divine solution, in the name of Jesus Christ. Everything about your life shall experience the power of divine lifting, in the name of Jesus Christ. As you step out of this prayer I decree, walk into your breakthrough. Walk into your success. Walk into your healing. Walk into your testimony. In the name of Jesus Christ. And come back with testimony. All those dreams you have been dreaming will manifest prettily. Say, Jesus, over to you. Lifted. I am lifted. I am lifted by your wall. And sorrow into the presence of mom. I am lifted, lifted. I am lifted. I am lifted. Into the presence of mom. Church Jesus. Church, you are doing well. You can do greater. You are doing well, but you can do greater. So I'm a, I'm a pastor that I feel it for you. You know, I've not come to this altar again for long to say, "Oh, if you want to have pass, come out." No, I know it's not too. It's very good. Life is sweet. Oh, I know life is sweet. People are dying in my life, but this life is sweet. I've not asked somebody for long if I want to pass come out. I have not. I just see one to one. If death come out, only five will redeem. Yesterday we were teaching about the way reduce service now. I feel we should not do that. Because ask Peter. I know what he said was correct. Petro, well, this is not it's not around one thirty, one forty now. But I don't know how they call it. And I give give money money that's even offering again. Peter, give me Jopé. Jopé will not sue me, my friend. Jopé is. Oh, put it past the man, put the man. You don't have put offering. But they put 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 the man. Don't put five pounds. Put offering. The spirit. Hallelujah. You can hold him Shh. We have no clues yet. Don't put this to follow us. Let it be still. Oh, spirit. B-E-D. Spirit. Always know that that people come in there know that you are better than somebody. Yeah. And we don't thank God. And that's for you know you see yourself fear. Your time has come. Daddy. They said they are serving a big God. Lord, be big in their life. As they go out to the Lord, be big in their life. So they will come and come back here and declare that God was big. Father God, be big in their life. Jesus will be big in their life. Say Jesus over to you and come back with testimony. Shout Jesus! I will see you Deliver us and people for four weeks, people four weeks will be clean next week. Four weeks.